Ever wondered how to install your PV modules? Want to avoid costly mistakes during the installation process? This video is going to give you some tips for installing Vertex modules. Before that, let's learn about the structure of Vertex modules. The front structure of Vertex modules includes an aluminum alloy frame, coated glass, encapsulated film, high-efficiency solar cells, and encapsulated film, back sheet, or coated glass. The back structure includes a nameplate, junction boxes, positive and negative cables, and connectors. There are installation holes, grounding holes and drain holes prefabricated on the frame. Understanding the module structure before installation will help you to finish the installation smoothly. Item Check Before module installations, please check whether the outer packaging is intact and check off the module type and quantity are consistent with the delivery slips. In case of any discrepancies, please contact Trina Solar Customer Service immediately. Installation Safety Trina Solar recommends that PV module shall be installed by professionals with experience in PV system installation. Local regulations and relevant international electrical standards shall be strictly complied with. Before installation, carefully check the modules for any abnormalities. In case of any abnormalities, please contact the dealer or Trina Solar customer service promptly. Do not install or handle any module on a rainy, snowy, or windy day. Do not wear metal jewelry during installation, which may scratch the modules and cause electric shock. Do not stand on the module to prevent the glass from cracking causing physical injury or electric shock. Installation must be conducted by two or more people. For more details of installation safety, please refer to the latest version of Trina Solar's user manual. Clamp installation. Start by placing the snap end of the clamp into the groove of the mounting structure. Adjust the direction of the clamp so that it is perpendicular to the mounting structure. Then place the module on the appropriate position of the clamp and insert it into the clamp. And make sure that the upper end of the clamp is tightly touched with the module frame. Tighten the bolts of the clamp. When installing the adjacent second module, after determining its position, tighten the clamp between the modules with bolts. Then tighten the clamp on the other side of the second module. During installation, use at least four clamps to fasten the module. Two clamps shall be installed on each long or short side of the module. Depending on the local weather conditions, use additional clamps to handle extra load if necessary. Electrical connection. When conducting electrical connection of the modules, according to the electrical requirements, the positive and negative connectors between the modules should be connected in turn. And when you hear a click, it indicates that the connection is successful. In order to avoid lightning strikes and ensure the safety of the electrical appliance, the module frame must be reliably grounded. Grounding between modules can be conducted by using 4 to 16 square millimeter solid bare copper to connect adjacent grounding holes on the module frame. Troubleshooting If your PV system does not work normally after installation, please inform your dealer immediately. It is recommended to perform preventive inspections every six months. Do not change the components of the modules without authorization. If electrical or mechanical performance inspection or maintenance is required, they should be operated by qualified professionals to avoid any electric shock or personal injury. For more information, please refer to the latest version of Trina Solar's user manual.